God, oh my God! Can you imagine? This is what it's like. That's what she's smelling like in winter. What's it going to smell like when it, you know average temperature is ninety five degrees outside with like ninety eight percent humidity? I would describe it as skunk. Jesus! Skunk oh my God! Time. Oh Jesus! Combination of rotten pineapple. Oh, I think I'm getting my. Oh. And uh, pukey pomegranate. Have you ever driven by a landfill in the peak of summer? I have. That's that will smell beautiful, like a botanical garden I compared have, to what's going to happen. Ever, have you ever been out on the beach when the red tide? Oh is my there? God! Oh, how's that smell on an August morning? Oh, well, we'll just come by here, come by the office, and you can huh? kind of get a little hint of remembrance. <laughs> In case I, I'm having oh. trouble remembering what, what it smells like on August morning. Jesus. I'll come back over here. Just come over here when there's no red tide. Just okay, come over skanky, here. Skanky, where are you? <laughs> skanky. Where are you? Come, Skanky, Skanky, Skanky. Do not. <laughs> oh, Kitty my God. Kitty wants some Skanky smell. Oh, Jesus. You know, I think there might be some some smells that are worse than that, but uh, I don't know. I to find out what they nothing are. comes to mind. Nothing's um, rising to the surface, so to speak. Because I'm, th- you know, I'm, I'm thinking if you have to like mix together several body fluids, let them sit outside in, <laughs> oh, in the summer. Here we go. <laughs> Just let them sit out there for a while in the summer, and then maybe, oh. maybe after a week of mm-hmm. of seepage and. Uh, <laughs> And and and, and, uh, and dehydration <laughs> and evaporation, yeah. mixing in with the various precipitates oh. and other people who are ultimately going to piss in that pot. This, if you mix, it, maybe it would smell similar to this smell, perhaps. Yeah, but that would that's but a, how would, that's but a lot of work. Do the test study to see if they were similar <laughs> smells. Who would you get? Well, you know, I get a smell over here. I'm trying to. I guess this is another smell that I think might be as skanky. Uh, let's let's test it. Let's set it off let's, in let's, the middle of the same people that were standing out at the uh, at the party the other see day. If they move. And see if uh, yeah, that, uh, see if I'm the only one who goes that outside would be the test study. If the what if, if this person wasn't there and you instead had a garbage can with a bag in it, right, and the this, same smell that could be equalized, right? You put that smell in the garbage can. Right. Put the garbage can out there. Sure. People would immediately say, "Get rid of that garbage can." Right. They would go. They would move it. They would right. get rid of it. Or better yet, put that not in the garbage can. Put that smell in a fanny pack. Have somebody put that and on and have the fanny just, pack on a table. No, no. Have that person walk around to the group and just kind of let well, that kind of happen, s- that happen swirl no, around. Do I don't think anyone would. But, well, I want to see if it's not attached to a person. Would people act different? If you put the fanny pack like on a table, or would people step away from it? Yeah. Would they say, "Oh, there's something"? Ooh, there's something wrong with me. the food on the table. Oh, it's probably in that fanny pack. Jesus, look at that. It's, ooh, it's somebody's fanny. But the, when it's attached to a person, it's like, oh, well, it couldn't be a person. It's too bad. It's got to be like, is the garbage all right in? It's where's the garbage? It can't be. That can't be coming from a person. It can't be. Ugh.